If you're thinking about getting a Doberman puppy, you better know what to expect financially. And I don't just mean what the puppy costs itself. I mean what all your initial startup costs are, the puppy food, all the equipment, and your ongoing monthly costs. So don't get a Doberman puppy until you see this video. We're gonna have a little bit of fun today. We're gonna load up my truck. We're gonna head down to the pet store. We're gonna get uh, some of the essentials. And we'll also come back. We'll talk a little bit about how much this costs. And uh, we're also gonna pull out a boatload of cash and uh, see if we can light it on fire to illustrate the point. That's a lot of money. Because sometimes that's exactly what it feels like owning a Doberman. So let's get to it. All right, first let's talk about the puppy prices themselves. Let's get the ledger up on the screen. There you go. Uh, American Doberman Pinscher. You buy an American Doberman Pinscher from a reputable breeder in the United States, uh, it's gonna run you somewhere between $1,500 to $2,500. Now, $1,500 is on the low end, that's for a pet quality Doberman. $2,500 is on the upper end, that's for more of a show quality Doberman. Now, other people may wanna get a European Doberman. Um, if you get a European Doberman and you buy them in the US, you're looking at a lot more money. You're looking at somewhere between $3,000 to $4,000. Now, there is ways to get European dogs cheaper. One way to do that is to buy a European Doberman in Europe. Uh, if you do that and you get it from a uh, country where it's a little bit cheaper, those countries are namely uh, usually Russia, Ukraine, and Poland. Those three countries, if you get a Doberman from one of those three, it's gonna be significantly cheaper um, and I'm, it'll be a European breed almost certainly. And that'll run you between $500 to $1,500 for a Doberman bought in one of those three countries. Um, now you are gonna have to keep in mind that you're gonna need to transport that dog back. You're looking at around $250 um, to fly back with that dog. Um, now you still have to buy your own plane ticket over there and back, but we're talking around $250 for the airline to fly the dog back with you if you're on the plane. Um, if you just want the dog shipped to you, um, without going over there and picking it up yourself, you're looking at $800 for shipping. So that's kind of what you can expect as far as the puppy prices go. For the sake of this video, we're gonna talk about the bare minimums for a lot of things. So I'm gonna say we're getting an American Doberman Pinscher and he's gonna be a pet quality because that's what I really want. I just want a pet, a really good pet for the family. And 1500 bucks, uh, I don't have the cash for that exactly, but we'll throw it on a credit card. Now let's talk about the additional initial costs or the startup costs that you'll need once you get a Doberman puppy. Keep in mind again, these are the minimums. These are if you're kind of doing things on a budget. Uh, I'm not gonna include costs for training. We're gonna assume that you're gonna train the dog yourself. Um, I think training is a great thing to do and I, I think you should get puppy classes, especially if this is your first Doberman um, or your first dog. But I'm gonna not include that here because again, these are minimum prices. So first off, let's talk about the stuff you need to get, uh, just kind of the bare essentials, the equipment you need. So for that, let's jump in my truck and let's head on over to the pet store. back from the pet store now and uh, that was a lot of fun but let's uh, go through the totals here let's get the ledger on the screen there you go um, now first thing we did was we got quality puppy food $85 dog treats another $20 toys dogs gotta have a lot of toys keep them busy $80 dog crate $75 dog bed $30 bowls leashes other gear Another $50. Lastly, the disposable supplies, carpet cleaner, waste bags, all that kind of thing. Another $50. All 
All right, that makes our total from the pet store $390. Now, on top of what you need from the pet store, there's gonna be a few other things that you just can't run in there and buy. So, on top of that, let's add on a few other things. Your initial vet checkup when you first buy the puppy, $65. That vet's gonna want you to get your initial set of vaccines, $105. I bet you that vet's also gonna charge you for your dog's deworming medications, flea medications, and tick meds. Another $60. Don't forget to get your cute new puppy a dog license with the county. Another $20. So between your first trip to the pet store and all your initial costs after that, you're looking at $640 on top of the puppy price of $1,500. That means initially at a bare minimum, we're into this $2,140. That's a lot of cash. In addition to that, you're gonna have to spend money every single month to own a big dog like a Doberman. First, you're gonna be talking about your monthly food prices. An average cost, would be, a good guess would be about $84 for quality pet food. Now you're gonna be looking at treats, another $20. Toys, another $15. Yes, and that is every month. They burn through toys. Health insurance, $40. Miscellaneous supplies, $10. Heartworm, flea, and tick medications. You gotta do that every month, that's $27. It just keeps going. The total, we're looking at $196, let's say $200. Just round it off $200 per month to own a Doberman. Now this is just average monthly cost. These are approximations based on my personal experience. Your experience may vary, but this could give you a good um, general idea of what you can expect. Sometimes guys, this hurts. It feels like you're just burning money. So let's do just that so you can see what it feels like sometimes. You gotta have a real, realistic expectation of what to expect. Let's get this money outside and let's burn it. We just finished talking about metaphorically burning money. So right before we get to literally burning money, um, I want to tell you guys that if you go to my website, dobermanplanet.com slash prices, um, you'll get to see a much more in-depth list of the expenses for owning a Doberman than I went over in this quick video. You'll also get to see all my first year expenses that I incurred um, owning my Doberman Cooper. I went through all my old uh, paperwork and totaled up my first year's expenses. I think you'll be surprised at the final number exactly what it is. So again, DobermanPlanet.com slash prices to see that um, kind of ridiculous final tally for the first year of owning my dog Cooper. Um, guys, I know getting all this stuff for Doberman can seem overwhelming. Do it one step at a time. Um, I will help you out too. Down below in the description, there is a link for my recommended products. Um, I keep a running uh, list on my website of all the products that I think work the best for a Doberman um, and that are easiest on the wallet. So, I mean, and they're broken down into categories, uh, food, treats, toys, all that kind of thing. So if you go down below, click on the recommended products link, you'll get to see the list of all the products that I recommend. And you can just kind of go through those and get most of your stuff. Um, Lastly, if you'd like and subscribe to my channel, that'd be great. Make sure you won't miss another awesome, informative Doberman video. And uh, that means a lot. So if you guys have had a dog and a crazy unexpected uh, expense, list that expense down below in the comments and the amounts. And let's have a little contest and see uh, who got burned the worst. Now let's get to literal burning. You want to own a Doberman? You better get used to doing this. Hold on one second, hold on. Okay. Uh, it's a lot of money, it's a lot of money. God, it's a lot of money. I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna do it, here we go. Don't think about it. I thought about it. No, I don't wanna do it, I don't wanna do it. They expect you to do it, they expect you to do it, you said you'd do it. You gotta deliver. You gotta deliver. Okay. 